All right, so this is how you use uh, BitNet with any model, any any model, any language model ever. Um, you just import from BitNet, import BitLinear. First, make sure that you have downloaded um, you have downloaded BitNet. So go pip install BitNet. Um, after you pip install BitNet, then you have this package, and basically all you need to do now is get every NN linear and find find the linear and then simply replace this to bit linear um, so what we're doing is we are taking every nn dot linear and we're going to swap swap this out with bit linear and that's basically it now you have bit linear added um, there's a couple of other things you can do which are a little bit more complicated um, such as swapping out the feed forwards with uh, bitnet and like Let's see if we can find. Um, here we're doing this on the Desi, um, Desi LLM architecture, um, as an example. But you could really do this with any LLM. You could do this with Llama, Mistral. Um, doesn't really matter. Um, you could do this with any uh, model. Um, so basically, yeah, that's it. So to integrate Bitnet, all you need to do is swap out the linear projections with the bit linear projection, um, and that's pretty much it. You could also swap out the attention. Um, some cases it's very easy to swap it out. Some cases um, it's very difficult to swap it out. Like this would be a little bit difficult to swap out um, because it's like kind of complex. There's a lot of stuff here. Um, what we can do is we can try to organize this code. Um, yeah, so that code was not really well implemented, um, but this is much more manageable. Yeah, so you could swap out this attention, this entire attention, um, using uh, BitNet. So to do that, you would um, first you would have to have all the same parameters, um, but you could just simply import bits. Uh, where, what was it called? Um, bits. Let me see if we can find it real quick. So there's a bit attention. Um, well, I guess I haven't put it there yet. But yeah, there's also a bit attention um, that you could swap out or bit fee forward. Um, if they're using fee forwards, which they are, I just don't know where because the code is kind of a mess. Um, yeah, so basically all you need to do to use uh, bitnets is swap out the linear projections and that's pretty much it. Now, one thing, you will need to uh, retrain the model, either fine tune it a little bit or train it from scratch. Um, you could also just swap it out and conduct difference, but it would not be good. Um, so take that into account. There's three things. If you want to um, obviously get performance, fine tune it. If you want to like use it for just for inference, um, it, I don't think it's, it'll be that good. Um, so you fine tuning is advised. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me know if you need any help. Join the Agora Discord, and yeah, let's let's start hacking. Thanks for your time.